Jim Swift tells us an Austin artist has drawn the attention of the First Lady. Amid the business as usual at the state capitol, came cruising down the hall a fellow determined to make waves in the governor's office. More on that in a minute. First, a little background. So I just heard probably on a news report that um, Mrs. Bush, uh, Laura Bush, was a supporter of the arts and was um, giving... Texas artists' exposure within the in the capital, uh, the governor's office. I think it's really important because I think our art in Texas, really, all of it. I mean, our songwriters, our music, our mariachi bands, our painters, our sculpture, all of it really sort of express who we are as Texans. So I thought, well, let's just see um, if she will be open to the idea of an art TV aquarium. He called us and said he uh, would love to set up an aquarium out there, and I thought that'd be great. And sure enough, she was most generous and offering me um, some space here for one of my pieces. So, Larry Pilch collaborated with well-known Austin photographer Alan Poe on a Barton Springs theme for the aquarium. Did you get Barton Springs at all? I don't get the Barton Springs at all. I used to when I lived here years ago when I was a librarian here. My girls go there, but actually, I'm seldom seen in a swimming suit. <laughs> <laughs> Pilts finished off his aquarium installation with five plump goldfish. Fish that, until he saved them, were being raised to come dinner for bigger fish. Hello, welcome home. Good morning, Governor's office. At last, it was finished. Hey, how Just are you? Just a moment, please. Oh, fine. <laughs> yes. And the First Lady was summoned for a look. But we're excited. Oh, well, me too. Very it much. looks great. The 20-gallon tank inside a 1951 RCA right. television chassis will remain here for as long as six months. A testimony to the allure of Barton Springs, to the notion that recycling can go beyond newspapers, bottles, and cans, to the whimsical creativity of Larry Pilts, and the purposeful energy of Laura Bush. Good morning, Governor's office. In the office of the governor and his wife, Jim Swift, News 36, television.